come to Asturias to uh, sample small calcite deposits on top of cave art. Right. Uh, and we can date when these form so we can get an age uh, for when the paintings were done. That's as close as I can get with my hand, so without touching anything. Already in Spain, we have dated uh, art that is 15,000 years older than previously thought, but it's also the oldest art that we have in Europe, uh, dating to at least 41,000. And what's interesting about that date is that we can't tell at the moment whether in fact it means it was painted by Neanderthals or whether it was painted by the earliest modern humans to arrive in Europe. Modern humans evolved around 200,000 years ago in Africa, but we don't find them using things that express uh, their symbolic thoughts until maybe 100,000 years ago. So the earliest paintings that we have are actually found here in Europe. And there's a really interesting question as to why it was in Europe that painting started rather than in Africa when modern humans have been around for a very long time. And there are several reasons why this might be. One is that Europe was populated by Neanderthals at the point at which modern humans arrived. And they may have had to reorganize themselves into different social structures in order to survive, in order to compete for resources and food. And therefore, they would need means of maintaining social cohesion. And that could be through new religious practices that required uh, the painting of caves, for example. <laughs> We're also interested in um, whether or not human symbolic behavior coincides, for example, with language, or whether uh, human symbolic behavior in fact dates right back to the point at which we start looking like humans, in which our skeletons look like they do today. And then we're also interested in whether or not Neanderthals themselves uh, could be producing art, um, and the dating of this will tell us whether or not they are made by modern humans or made by Neanderthals. It is big news, and it, but it's big news, I think, because people have dismissed Neanderthals as symbolic individuals. But in fact, elsewhere in Spain, we find evidence for Neanderthal use of pigment, perhaps as, as body adornment, makeup, if you like. So it wouldn't be too surprising to find out that they also painted caves. <laughs>